A controversial chemical known as PX has been making headlines in China. Most of those headlines involve protesters trying to stop PX factories. But on Thursday, a unique forum was held that was aimed at pitching PX to a wary public. CCTV reporter Ai Yang reports now from Beijing. Hundreds of petrochemical experts, enterprise leaders and environmental researchers have gathered in Beijing to talk PX. The forum is the first of its kind in China. Participants hope to improve public understanding in this matter and promote the development of the PX industry in China. We hope to better inform the public on perexcelling related matters. PX has already been demonized in China by people who understand little of it. And this has made it very difficult for the PX industry to grow in China. With the recent rapid growth of China's polyester industry, there's an increasing demand for PX, but market supplies lag far behind demand. Local governments and industry this opportunity as a strong engine for GDP growth. However, new project constructions in recent years have met with growing opposition from the public, who fear PX is toxic and the production waste may endanger their living environment. So far in China, PX production hasn't caused any significant accidents. Petrochemical plants do pose risks, but we have very strict environmental evaluation and risk management systems to ensure the safe construction of every project. Most of the equipment used to manufacture PX are imported, and our technology and regulation is up to the international standard. However, many people still feel these projects are not transparent enough, and they question what kind of government supervision take place in an absence of public involvement. Right now, government supervision is not thorough enough. We should learn from overseas experience, invite third-party inspectors who are petrochemical experts to supervise enterprises, report problems to the government, rather than just have environmental experts who are not familiar with the industry. Also, enterprises should invite local residents to visit their plants regularly to see for themselves if the production process is safe and environmentally friendly. China is the world's largest peroxylene consumer. However, in recent years, it has met with growing obstacles from the public in building more petrochemical plants. At this forum, participants say project transparency, as well as more public involvement in the decision-making process, will help ease public concerns in the future. Ai Yang, CCTV, Beijing.